our week-long series, Where Are They Now?, with a beauty queen from the 90s. She was Miss Hawaii in 1991 and went on to become Miss America in 1992, making her the first ever Miss Hawaii to achieve this national honor. And joining us this morning live via Skype is the former Miss America herself, Carolyn Sapp Daniels. Good morning and aloha to Good you, morning. Carolyn. Good morning. And I guess our first question is literally, where are you now? Where are you Skyping from? I'm Skyping from my home in California. And so I'm, background noise would be my three children. <laughs> So I guess that's what we should be asking you now is what are you up to besides being a busy mom? I basically stopped working um, on the Walmart issue and the women's issues when I had my first child. And I just decided to stay home and be a stay-at-home mom. I worked over 25 years and I wanted to have that experience and I'm so blessed. And uh, we'll ask you about the Walmart issue in just a moment because I know that was a, you were very uh, passionate about that. But let's go back to those pageant days and we've got the video. We've been looking at it all morning long when they said your name for Miss America. What went through your head back in 1992? I have to tell you, I was in shock. I mean, small town girl from Kona. I just, I felt overwhelmed with love. I had so much you know, support from Hawaii. It was incredible. So I think for me, that was icing on the cake. And as you mentioned, it's been quite an adventure. You've done everything from singing to acting to activism. Um, I guess you've always been an, an out, outspoken person, and, and this gave you a, a platform, this opportunity? I, basically, women's issues. I started out doing domestic violence and also child abuse and that was a life for me for over 20 years. I also had my own foundation, Safe Places for Abused Women and Children. And then I moved into a women's issue which is the Walmart issue which brought up Duke versus Walmart which was the largest class action sexual discrimination suit in American history. And that was pretty phenomenal that that happened. Well, right, and, and uh, it was a Quite, a, quite, quite surprising to see you involved in something like this, I think, for, for a lot of us. And Carolyn, you know, we see a picture of you and your kids. It looks like Halloween, the kids, and you have the crayon costumes on. Why don't you talk about your family and what they mean to you? I think for me, being family, being from Hawaii, we are so family oriented and for me it was a blessing to be able to take the time off from work and focus on my family. I think I, I preached about it as a single woman in my young 20s about family's importance in raising your children and how important that is in the community, whether it was business, whether it was church, whether it was just your community. We all needed to lift our children up, and now I get to live it. And that's powerful. And so now I'm ready. My youngest is almost three, and I'm going back to work. And I'm excited, actually, because in just a couple days, I'm going to start promoting Hawaii through Andy Bumatai in his In the Car series. So oh. I'm working with, yeah, he's actually coming here to stay, and we're going to get him to see some of the locals that have been transplanted to California. And I'm working with Brooke Lee, Miss Universe. Mm -hmm. And so it's been really exciting to promote Hawaii in this way. And oh, then yeah, I'm, and I'm gonna and I'm gonna just get back out on the road and start being an activist again because now I have the real life experience of having children. Well terrific. Congratulations. How Thank often you. are you gonna be able to make it home though to Hawaii? <gasps> Well, I have a house in the North Shore with my husband, and so we make it home quite a bit. So we we go back and forth, and my family's still in Kona. Hi, Mom. Hi, my brother, <laughs> my sister. Hello, all my family in Hawaii. I miss you and love you. All right. Well, Carolyn Sapp Daniels, thank you so much for joining us. It's great thank to see you. you, and we definitely want to see you in person here at KITV very soon. I would okay. love that. I would love that. You guys have a great day. Thank you. You too. You too. Now to view this interview again or to watch any of our segments on Where Are They Now, you can go to this morning section on KITV.com. And there she is, Miss America.